everybody! We're back at the quarry, exactly where we left off! Look at that beautiful old face of this old lady, but this time, we have a Diet Coke. Mmm, the beautiful taste of aspartame. Mmm. Alright, what are we getting into? Who's gonna die? What tarot cards do we have? How many have I missed? Oh, sweet mother of god. Okay, well, never mind. They're kind of useless to me, anyway. I wonder if we're gonna go to the scrapyard at any point, because we talked about that and it was shown on the map. I think I'm gonna hit, like, every location that's been on these maps. And if not, I'm gonna be upset. Chapter 7! Get so, that, Chivo! Uh, why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. Damn. Who took your eye? Was it Ted Raimi? I'll get him. Was it Dewey? Oh, now we're back in June, okay. Still have our eye. We didn't get Solid Snaked yet. Or Big Bossed. Solid Snake doesn't lose his eye, he just has a digital eye patch. Or like a mechanical one. Oh, Max. Wait, is he still alive? No. Clearly he dies anyway, because... He's not with us in current time. Oh, because now he got bitten, so he's gonna turn. There's no saving him anyway. No, oh, spooky. Ma'am. This is gonna get a little messy. So, maybe, maybe he's not actually one of them, but he's just, I feel like, um, Chris, Dewey, David Arquette, I feel like his family are the werewolves, clearly his kids are. Maybe Ted Raimi isn't. Oh, God. Oh, lighting broke. I do like that. Uh, transformation though. How it's not that like slow, like bones breaking, skin shedding, it's just like BOOM! Werewolf! <clears throat> if they even are werewolves, I just keep calling them that because. What have you done to Max? Shut up. <laughs> okay. You just shut up! You're the one who woke me up! <laughs> this is an interrogation. I ask. You answer. Y yes, yes, sir. <clears throat> Name. Compliant? Um, I'll be compliant, why not? <clears throat> Laura Kearney. I just want information out of him. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brinley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Uh, I'll be angry now. I'll be sassy. Well, I'm not saying shit until you tell me where Max is. I said so. You can't keep us here. I know what this is. This is an illegal detainment. They are waiting for us at Hackett's Quarry, and pretty soon they're gonna figure out we're missing. I want a lawyer. You finished? <laughs> no, I want a phone call too. Okay, Sheriff. Hack it. Wait, hack it? Like, Chris Hackett? Don't change the subject. 
What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? Yeah, yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. I mean, I think he's there to help. Like, I'm already in the shit. Now he's like, damn it, how do I get you out of this? So. Please. You just. Stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is. Is Max alive? I feel like I'm going crazy. What? Yeah, it's isn't it better to just we're not lashing out, okay? We're we're staying calm. I'm not making the situation worse. Isn't it better to just bring me to see Max and be like, that's okay. Max. That's what happened. Otherwise, she's just not going to believe you. Hey. I forgot that they changed hey, back to normal. You <laughs> asshole! <laughs> what, else, what the fuck's going on? I forgot that what? Nick can just Why turn back to normal. Me? Outside of a full moon. Are you okay? Max, are you okay? Yeah. I just ripped off my pants. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm kind of all mixed up, but more or less intact, I think. Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked, the next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're gone, and now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. I mean, what the fuck happened? Something you might know. I was kind of hoping you could tell me what happened. I feel like I remember bits and pieces, but none of it makes any sense. Yeah, same. I, I feel like... Were we drugged? I feel like maybe we were drugged. By a cop? Do they do that? Oh, probably, yeah. Who does this guy <laughs> think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge, and... And it's not important, I'll tell you later. Get dressed. What's he giving you? Not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? It, they're trying so hard to make him like big bad scary cop, but every time he interjects and says shit is like Why why would you say that here now? Of course, they're gonna talk to each other. That's not even really a bad thing for you I wasn't aware we needed your permission detective dick whip it. <laughs> yeah, it's a free country officer out for brains <laughs> <laughs> Good one All right, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. Man, you must go through so many pairs of clothes as a werewolf. Your turn. Every time you explode out of them. Not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Just like the Hulk. Come on. Hey, hey. Get the go? fuck off. Come on. Move. Good boy. 
Hey! Stop struggling! Max, calm down. You're only making it worse. Laura. What the hell did you do to her? Shut up. You give me the... You give me the ability of foresight, where I can see what's happening in the future. Laura, I think there's got to be something in here you can use. Because that cop's just trying to mitigate disaster, even though he's a bit of an asshole about it, but... I feel like... Max is probably going to get killed, or he's still one of those things running around. He might be still one of them that I have been seeing as I've been going around, or... He got killed and transformed, and that's what. Maybe he's the one who like clawed her eye out. They got like too close. And then he transformed. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. A scrawled limerick. Limerick is a county in Ireland, by the way. That's where I went to college. This doesn't paint a particularly favorable picture of Sheriff Hackett, and perhaps this isn't the first time he's locked someone up illegally. This is America! I told you. Why is this one? I guess it attaches to something else. Okay. It's a spoon. Ew. Spoon? Someone bent it with their mind. The secret is to believe that there is no spoon. What is that the kid says in the Matrix? <clears throat> Sis. Fake brick. Not a chance. <laughs> but with sort of lever. Oh, the spoon! Use the spoon! The almighty spoon! Have you seen the spoon? <laughs> <laughs> that could work. Yeah, oh, yeah, it's spooning time. Oh, yeah, this ought to do it. <laughs> ah, yes. You could have done that without the spoon. What? Oh, this music sounds like Predator. Hi, Max. Welcome back. Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Give me a break. <laughs> Not anymore, you don't. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Second you get out. <laughs> what the fuck is that supposed to mean? You ain't getting out, buttercup. Hey! What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? I know, must be some sort of leave cop us thing. In here. Hey! Come back! Fuck! <laughs> some binky bucky. Son of a what? You could have gone real artistic there and had both of them sit down in their chairs and have it be like a split screen of both of their faces facing out and have it symmetrical of both of them being in the same position. That's what I would have done. Uh, are you okay? Are you okay? It's just a foot. It'll heal. Binky bonky. I the interrogation. Oh. Yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. He, uh, 
He just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning. And I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Why, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. Rude. <clears throat> oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like THE Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's THE Chris Hackett? <laughs> As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Man. Give him a break, his brain Last exploded. Night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? <laughs> huh? Did someone pass wind? Ugh. Reflecting he's not acting like a kidnapper. I mean, he's not. But... Kidnappers don't usually put you in jail cells at their police station. Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? True. I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you have to. <laughs> Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? Maybe. This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. He didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that! Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. <clears throat> We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... Gonna, gonna be, a, be a dog man. What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. I... I was embarrassed. Your grades were good, and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck! You've been making plans, Max, what the fuck? I don't know, what do you want me to say? Hmm. Maybe sorry I lied to you? Uh, let's be empathetic. As an empath, I can tell that something's wrong here, guys, and you're just gonna have to, like... I'm gonna have to play Oprah here for a second, get you guys back together, and then, like, give away a car or something. I'm sorry, Max. This... This really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. True. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. True. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? True. Yeah. 
Yeah, I do. True. I'm a matchmaker. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great. Sign me up. True. <laughs> we need to go over it from the beginning. <clears throat> like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. Oh, I was weird before that. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? Oh, you mean it was that like he thing. already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's got to be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... Nobody else around. Small town. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something. Ian. <laughs> and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Like person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got lost? <laughs> well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month. Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. Max gets it. What if... Uh... Okay. No. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Hell yeah! Vindication! Goddamn mine. Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? I called it from the very start. What, 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 what's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like... Zombies, aliens. That'd be sick. Time hopping. Dracula's. I would love an aliens version of a game like this. God, I. What I would love from Supermassive is either uh, um, honest recreation of the thing, the movie, the first one. Imagine a game like this, but it's the thing, and you're in the Antarctic, and you're in this small little, like, base, and you have to figure out whose blood reacts and who's infected. God, a game like this revolving around the thing would be so fucking cool. Um, or aliens. Aliens would be awesome. Like, you're in, you're at home, and, like, the light beams come through the window shutters, and... Your whole house starts shaking, dust everywhere, someone gets abducted, and then later on you have to go to the town and you're in, like, Roswell, and... God, please make a game about aliens! And not some, like, hokey-pokey aliens, I mean, like... I don't even know what hokey-pokey means. But, like, do it justice, like, do a real serious movie about aliens, or a game, or whatever. I fucking love alien stuff. Ryan, shut the fuck up. <laughs> okay, I'll be Cam. Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. <laughs> I um, like her. Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. Werewolves is pretty rational. Okay, you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's 
bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She's got a whole poem about it. <laughs> There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish, then you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. We're not going to another flashback, are we? The next few weeks were long. Yeah. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot, as much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. Hey, at least they're working out a little. <laughs> I feel like that's what I would do. Just pure calisthenics for ages. I can't take this anymore. <laughs> it's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. <laughs> We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. Weeks? God That's damn. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? Full moon's gonna happen to eventually. Only to be stopped when. I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth. Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. It's hot. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or we try to catch him off guard and make our escape. Um, I think eventually full moon's gonna happen and Max is gonna get us out of here one way or the other anyway. Uh, uh. Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch and mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? That'd be tight. Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know, I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. Hmm. The only reason I'm not thinking about escaping is because he might come in handy later, and if I'm in a if I'm a shithead to him now. Then he might show up at the camp later and then not help us. Or escaping also means like getting into a fight and like people can get hurt and somebody gets shot or worse. Uh, yeah, I'll be. Oh, there's like a little fuzz floating in the air past her eyebrow. That was cool. Like, I kind of want to be optimistic. I don't want to be resigned. I think we should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. Yeah. So what's he waiting for? Look, we just... If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Deal. You can try this and then the other. Full moon's gonna happen, baby! So... Alright, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's gotta have a weak spot, like something we can use. The testicles. Not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Meanwhile, he's listening on the cameras. Comes in with a full jock strap. He's like, my testicles are not weak today. Hey, hey! T 
T-Money. Can I call you T-Money? Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Do we know Hackett? his first name? Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, T-Money, lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. <laughs> and one of them is a werewolf. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. Oh. I see what you're doing. Oh, come on, man. Well, it's not gonna work. You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole. Max! All right, we're breaking out. You know what's going on? We know Max is a werewolf! Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. <laughs> okay. Maybe there is more to I it. I said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off! Get back! Max, what's going on? <laughs> Get the fuck away from him! He's turning. Come here. Shut up. Have a seat. Yeah, have a look at what's about to happen to him. Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not going to believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. I'm not gonna call for help. It's not gonna fucking do anything. Dewey's in on it. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry. I'll be back at dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Back at dawn? What if he breaks out? Oh god, is he gonna break out and she has to escape and kill him and he scratches her eye? I should know, I wrote this game. He's like, I'm feeling, feeling like I really want to howl at the moon. He's like, I'm feeling really, ow, you know? Ugh. Don't worry, Max. I'm here. Yeah. Yeah, right. Are you all right? Uh, yeah. I don't know. I just don't feel so good. Um, what do you need? What can I do to help? I was just hot. Are you hot? Oh, I'm kind of stuck next to this big-ass pipe, so I'm not exactly cool. Just stay back, okay? You shouldn't be this close. There's not a lot I can do about that right now. Give it to us. Show nice. us the meat explosion. I feel like I want to be on all four suddenly. Tell me what's going on. <laughs> Here we go. Kasploosh. Woof, woof, bark, bark. 
Oh, he just did it like that. <laughs> She's like, Ew. God, he didn't even have to escape. Wait, unless he escapes, maybe he's still there then. Fuck! Oh. Uh. That's usually that's how I'd react if my eye got clawed out. I'd be like, ah, dang it! Fuck! Ah, that was my C and I. Here we go, big boss time. Yeah, Colonel, can you hear me? <laughs> so much for depth perception. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a goofy fucking line! <laughs> oh. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. It's like getting your ha like dealing getting his hand chopped off, being like, so much for being a lefty. <laughs> Yeah, he's still there. He's still there. I'm not going near him again. I might lose my other eye. Wait! That means she can't die here, right? If she's alive in the future, then nothing I do here can get her killed. Otherwise, you create some sort of paradox. Alright, what you hiding? What you hiding around here? Fucking chariot card? I knew it. I knew you were hiding some tarot cards around here. I could sense them. That's what I do, I sense things. God damn it, door is locked. What's he hiding? Whoa, that music sounded like, um... The Dark TV show? The German show on Netflix? A phenomenal TV show, by the way. I highly recommend you watch it. It'll do you good to get a little culture in you, okay? Listen to some German, learn some words. It's a cool language, all right? Uh, but yeah, that music sounded like it. At least look up the soundtrack. <clears throat> Again, another show that deals with like time travel and stuff, which I'm very partial to. All right, let's head upstairs. Sorry, I'm walking into the banister. I lost an eye, okay? I can't exactly see where things are. It's gonna take me a while to figure it out. That. I'm gonna need to rest soon. <clears throat> Did I hear footsteps? That weren't mine? Whoever was wearing this cap be doing too well. Kind of feels like the previous sheriff turned into one of these things and now he just took the badge. This old sheriff's badge is badly fire damaged. Does it belong to the current sheriff or one of his predecessors? Probably the fire we've heard about before from Harum's Scarum. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry, the Peanut Butter Butter Pops. Peanut Butter Butter Pop, Peanut Butter Butter Pop, Peanut Butter Butter Pop. That's fun to say. Is that it in here? Come on. You gotta have more up your sleeves. It can't be just that sheriff's badge. Ha! Well, that's disappointing. Bum, 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 bum. We last of us now, boys. A serange. Used be what he used to, not to be. drug me in my neck. I can hide this in my cell. Okay, you're not gonna attack him, are you? 
I, I keep saying maybe he shows up later to help us. Maybe he's fucking dead. <laughs> maybe she just straight up shivs him when he comes back. On the 24th. Birthday bears, let's go! July 7th. Actually, no, it's the... Uh, it's June 11th. I need to lie down. Right now. Is that it? I just came up here for a fucking syringe. I mean, I got a tarot card as well, but... I don't even know who Tara is. Wait, what just the... Oh, I didn't go in here. Ha. Mama's boy. Travis. 56. That means he was born in 1965. Mm-hmm. Okay. So at least now I know his name. Travis Hatcher. Thatcher. Hackett. Thackett, not Hatcher. What am I saying? Locked. Figures. And I guess I can't leave Max. Better keep snooping, or I could go back to my cell and wait, I guess. Bunga, 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 bunga. I think we can just go back to my cell and wait. I got a syringe, I got a tarot card. Sleepy time! There's no blanket on this bed. Good night, Max! Dude comes back, he's like, you're not sitting there? He's like, oh god, what happened? <laughs> you want to tell me what happened? I could ask you the same thing. It's not his blood. Why didn't you run? I won't leave Max. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. <laughs> so, do you think she... Oh, shit! Oh. So you made yourself at home. I didn't put it in the fucking wall! That's what you used to knock me out with, isn't it? This is dangerous. Could you not I... have used that on Max last night? <sighs> Maybe I'd still have two good eyes. I didn't even think about it. All yes. I thought about was... Yes, but it's really fucking hard to do. Oh, stupid. She was just like, I'll hide it in my cell, and I thought, oh, video game, it'll do it on its own. <laughs> of course I had to do it. Oh, I even saw the prompt and everything, and I just didn't even think about it. Whatever. We get out of here eventually, right? What's this? An education. Watch. It's the Bible. <laughs> Jesus is watching you. Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean. Thank you. It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal. 
doctor, and no, I'm not, and I probably never will be stuck in here forever. You know, just because you know doesn't mean you know. You know? I have uh, no idea what you're talking about. What? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're going to end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. Okay. I kind of want to know if he's going to answer this. So, how is your family involved? My family is down at the bottom of a well. What? Family is the most important thing in the world. But if your whole family, you know, like every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope. How can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. If you pull on that rope, and you're just gonna fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. Hmm. And what's the point of that? Right, so you... He looks right at us. You're the one at the top of the well with a rope, and... Yes. I thought that was obvious. Yeah, yeah. okay, yeah, I got it. He said that. <laughs> Forget it. Let's see how smart you really are. Do my crossword puzzle for today. <laughs> Finish the Sudoku. What is this? Information. Well, what does it mean? Read it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver and the first, when moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight or fear the dread of full moon's light. Is that saying kill the first werewolf? Yeah. Keep reading. I'm not gonna take the gun, come on, Jesus. And if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. And <clears throat> frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? I don't know. But it's all we have to go on. Kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver, it has to be full moon. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. I just want to cure Max. It's not as straightforward as you think.
If you knew all this, why didn't you just kill it in the storm shelter when you had the chance? It's not so, I'm, I, I was, when I- Straightforward? No, yeah, it's so not, you... they're not so easy to hit. I was trying to protect you two. Hmm. <clears throat> so what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. I haven't even started. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Look. Take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Seen enough? I wonder what he was watching. I also forgot that it's 2021 in the game, so he just gave him an iPad. I keep thinking it's supposed to be back in the 80s, and that makes no sense because everyone has phones. It just has, like, the 80s feel. I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't... If I hadn't seen that. Oh, he showed him footage of himself. <clears throat> I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. You know, you clawed my eye out. <laughs> well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're going to fix it on our own. Yeah, that sounds smart. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye. Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. It's not exactly his fault. I mean, he almost died. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. <clears throat> but it was. We're gonna fix you, Max. I promise. I promise. She promises, man. She means it. Said, Let me in there. Rick, I know they're in there. Who? The counselor didn't show up. How'd you find out? Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. Why? Why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here, that's fucked up. I fucking bit one of them, Chris. What's I supposed to do? <sighs> what was that? Oh. So it was him that was in the cellar. You shot me. I'm telling Mom. I think your lucky stars wasn't silver. <laughs> You shot plan. me, I'm telling mom! Can't keep him here forever. I'm handling it. <clears throat> Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Are those know hikers? It. That, that, that fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we gonna do now? Whatever happened to... We're all in this together. 
Shit, man. Let's go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. Max! Uh. Max! Uh. <laughs> what is it? Travis I like Max. Was just in the hall talking, the cop. So? With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? I mean, I did. I mean, I guess, thinking about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter, because it was his fucking brother! God, it's so obvious! If, yeah. If Chris was the one that bit me, then... Yeah, then that's our cure. That's how we fix you. That's Jesus, fun. Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. Fuck yeah! I'm down! That sounds like fun! Hey! Hey! Help her! Laura needs help! Uh, Laura! Just don't kill Travis! Laura, are you okay? God damn it. What the hell is going on? Laura! <laughs> We're quick. Give me the keys. You don't have to do this. Oh. Uh, yeah, I do. I'm sorry, but I do. Let's just talk about it. You had your chance to talk. Keys. Okay. Okay. Fuck. Oh. Uh... Hurt him, man. He's just trying to put out fires everywhere. This is the path I've chosen. I never knew you had it in you. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Come on, Laura. Please think about what you're doing. <laughs> you're not so tough. Why don't you take some time? Think about why you're in here. I'm sorry. He's not a bad guy. He's just in awful circumstances. We should grab our staff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. What is it? I thought I heard someone. Someone thinks he's here. No, I, I still can. I'm still not sure how this plays into the whole plot. This it's coming from behind that door. Wait, you can hear it too?
I know it's saying like kill Chris Hackett and There's I mean in here. What the fuck? I like Max more than I like Chris Hackett. But I don't really want to kill him. Them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month hunting. Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. Hey, I just realized something. We're free. <laughs> Hell yeah, we are. That's two months we'll never get back, but for now, we're one step closer to going home. And when is that? Tonight. Going to Hackett's quarry, and we're killing Chris Hackett. So she shows up there, kills the kid. But where's Max in all of this? I mean, it is a full moon that night, so maybe he did just turn and he's the one that attacked Nick. Or was the one that attacked Dylan, or maybe that's the same one, I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell them apart. Maybe he's the one that was locked up. Maybe she locked him up in the thing, and then Emma let him out. That would make a lot more sense why I one of them was locked here. up up there. To camp. Left, left Max at the island. Seemed like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. Yep. That's it. That's the story. So he's the one that attacked Emma. And I'll jump in at the same time. Wait. The island? Like, like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh, shit. <clears throat> They're not there now? I mean, do you know that? I actually don't know where they are. <clears throat> well, as long as they didn't go poking around where they shouldn't have, they're probably fine. Poking around where he shouldn't have is Jacob's middle name. This is very bad. <laughs> oh. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. But he was gone. Laura's such a badass. I'm so glad she's not dead. I mean, I figured she wasn't dead completely because the start of the game she just got syringed. Um, but I'm glad both of them are alive because I really like her as a character. She was cool at the start of the game and she's still cool. I think she's my favorite one. The, the ghosts! They're, they're, they're singing! What are they singing about? Max? Oh, Maxi! Where are you? I mean, it's a full moon. Why are you calling out his name? Max! You know that if it's a full moon, he'll turn. Do werewolves in regular mythos, do they turn into werewolves even if the moonlight doesn't hit them? Max? Ah! Hello? Ah, oh, shite. Well, he can't kill her here either. <laughs> oh, shit. Is water and werewolves like a thing in like current werewolf mythology as well? I've never heard that. Like everyone knows the silver bullets thing, but I've never heard of clear clean water doing anything to them. Oh, 
Okay, bye, Max. I'll be fine. I'll be back. Don't worry. Cool. So the werewolf I killed can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Kaylee, Kaylee Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless, I, I guess, it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait, so... How come Max didn't kill you, though? Wait, he bit you? He tried. I got away. I need to end this. We don't have much time. Why isn't she turning into one then? She's so cam. <gasps> Lin Shay. I forgot that you were supposed to be in the game. So this is our new gas. Smell good, don't I? Dumb fucking animal. <laughs> I wonder who she has. Okay, bye, Ling Shay. Uh, let me go! Let me fucking go! Get your hands off me! Uh, uh, I'll call the cops, yeah! Let me go! Alright? Let me go, Mark! I'll call the fucking cops! Uh. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Because <laughs> that was funny. That's... <laughs> oh, fuck. Well, it's not Jacob, because it was in okay. cell seven. Oh, <laughs> So if we assume that Chris is still out there, we have Nick, we have Max. Max is still That's on the island, Bobby. and maybe Chris's son? Maybe it's Nick that gets caught hey. and put in there. Hey! Hey, where are you going? Hey! Hey! Oh, he's already in there. Fucking music. <laughs> Maybe I can tell which werewolf it is based on like the clothes they're wearing, but I can never get a good look at it, and I forget what they were wearing. Ah, oh, that's cool though. Nice. So there could still be like two or three out there. I don't know. I never really know how many of them there are. Hey, we're back. It's always nice to see you. Isn't it fun delving into the past? They're a bad lot, aren't they? Well, we also have to figure out which character's well, we talking to her. Or maybe it's just me as the player and there is no character talking to her. The chariot. chariot. At the reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer. Taking <sighs> control, relying on determination to make our choices. Valiant, but in some cases, foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots. But perhaps, in some cases, they're not as safe as we think they are. Mm. And the same question as always. 
Will you let me show you more? Yes, you may, if we don't, please. That was it. You'll be seeing me a few more times before the night's over. Yeah. I look forward to that. Can't wait. As long as you follow the right path, of course. Sure, yeah. Yeah. Bye, lady. Chapter 8, The Belly of the Beast. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. What a rude. <laughs> Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Uh, Caitlin, what do I do? Uh, Caitlin, what do I do? Oh, wow, real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <sighs> oh, no way. I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Look, just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. Unconvinced. All this over a poem? You said you heard a woman. Yeah, I want to, I want to like ask questions. I want to get to the bottom of things. I don't want to be like, shut up, and then start shooting people. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. <laughs> Your bracelet. <laughs> I'll shoot you. Let's not do that. Doing? I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. What's she doing? But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Ryan, put that fucking thing down before you hurt Because it's silver? So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. We need to find a head werewolf then. If you kill the head werewolf, won't all the others be fine? What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Dude! What? Have you thought about not killing him? Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Okay, any clothes are going to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh... Yeah, what they said. <laughs> well, who bit Chris Hackett then? There has to be like a, a higher wolf. The head wolf, if you will. An alpha. Uh, Chris has nothing to do with this. But I know that he does. Ah, whatever. I'm gonna show you that Chris Hackett has nothing to do with this. He wanted us to stay inside tonight. He wanted us safe. I don't care what you think. I don't care what you think. Shut up. You should. Fine. Do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. 
Everyone is saturated in blood. That cop car you stole, where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How All of have? this! An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. All of this is because Jacob wanted to have sex with Emma one last time. He wanted to rekindle that that relationship and stole the rotor arm. And all of this is happening to us because of that. Are you sure this is the right way? Well, except Laura. Pretty sure, yeah. Pretty or definitely? What do I look like, a tour guide? I'm, I still don't know if I trust Ryan. This doesn't feel right. I think you're up to something. I'm not. You better not just be running out the clock. I'm not. I know, it sounds sus to me, bro. I'm August. Because he's been really weird about this whole situation the, the whole time. The longer we're out here, the longer we're in danger. Said the murderer. You know, it might be a lot more pleasant if you lighten up a little. What is wrong with you? Uh... I've had kind of a fucked up summer. Yeah, well... Doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Oh, what's that supposed to mean? I don't know, I... You're still alive. I guess. Nobody else needs to get hurt. An eye for an eye makes the whole world blind. No offense. Yeah. I'm not doing this for revenge. I need to Yeah, what if they cut out my eye? You're doing all of this for a boy? What am I supposed to do? Just leave him like this? I owe it to him. Like I said, kind of a fucked up summer. Yeah, I was in jail for two months. <laughs> You guys have been living this for what? Three hours? Four hours? <laughs> there it is. Hack your house. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there, but. If we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. Underground. Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. Laura, Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. Hey, where are you going? Your own timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. I got you! Careful, it's gonna go! <laughs> oh. <gasps> oh! What do you mean, I got you? You didn't have shit! Are you okay? Laura? Oh yeah, she's werewolfy. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Great. Oh my God, Laura! Jesus, Marion, jazz hands. Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. She get her eye back? Whoa! What big eyes you have, Grandma? No shit! Can you see yellow in my eyes? Define yellow? Shit. 
We haven't got much time. That's kind of cool. I like that. All right, time to shotgun it up. But first, I have to search for tarot cards. Any around here? There's one over there. I see it. I see it. Oh, that was this thing. I thought I saw a card. What this? This must be. Hold on. Chapter eight: Quarry mines. The forgotten belongings of a quarry miner abandoned in the tunnel. In the tunnels, a letter of foreclosure within indicates that this has been down here since the 1930s. Part of the old working quarry. Makes sense. Last time I trust a hack it. Oh, okay. Oh man, I can't go out that way. Oh man, I gotta walk all the way around again. Come on. Oh, so this is why it's called the quarry, because this is an actual like mining quarry now. I mean quarry also means like your your prey. Like a hunter's quarry. So I guess it's a double meaning. Oh hell yeah. Minecraft. These must have been from the quarry days. No duh. No one's been down here for years. <laughs> Now the thing is though, if Chris Hackett is a werewolf and he's out there somewhere, like we're not just gonna walk into his house, find him and kill him. We don't even know which werewolf is Chris. That looks like something on the wall right there, a little white dot. Did you hear that too? It's her. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. What if what if that ghost lady isn't even real? It was just Lin Shay, the actress lady, walking around in the woods, being like, Silas! And then she like sprints somewhere else and hides behind trees. Oh, shit. You think anyone heard that? No, they can't have done. This place is not up to code. I if we heard Silas, then literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. <laughs> Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Mm. Thank you, by the way, for blessing me. <laughs> Walk much? Jeez. <laughs> yeah, we heard Silas, and then they're like, "Do you think they heard all these pipes falling?" Ah, I knew it. So I keep walking into these little holes. So I'm like, there's gonna be a card somewhere around here if I walk far Let's enough. Look at this place. Oh. Okay. Nobody tosses a dwarf. <laughs> Don't tell the elf. I could really do with a hamburger right about now. <laughs> Stop being weird. <laughs> All right. Because if I kill Chris, then that means oh, I probably boy, save that? Nick and... Whoa. Nick and Max, but... I could kill someone ahead of Chris and then save him. Do you Ooh. think, actually, something is in here with us? Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Cool, great. Love that. This section of the game feels like Resident Evil. A long way down. Oh, yeah. I don't want to be here. Cave in. Do not enter. Well, where's cave out? <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone. <sighs> 
I'm gonna take the shot, guys. I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> oh, Jesus. So what's your deal, then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? Mm. You know that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? I mean, until now. What about your friend, uh, Caitlin? Is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. I guess. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of closer to Dylan, though, after tonight, uh, I don't know. The trauma can bring people together. Yeah, and vodka. So what about you? Who do you like more? I don't know. Maybe neither. What? Yeah, you do! You do! You know! You do! We didn't go through all that flirting, chopping right. off his hand, keeping light. him alive. Yeah. You and Caitlin have nothing together. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. I'm upset. Yeah, I'm upset, but I need to do this. Someone's been eating their spinach. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? Let me just get a move on. We're, we're kind of on a ticking arm here. Hey! At least that one you can't miss. Shoot the barrel. See if it explodes like a video game. Oh, this really feels like the end of Until Dawn see. now. You know, we've had some crazy moments with Ryan in the game so far. I'm not really digging him as a character. I don't know, I'm not- I'm not like vibing with him. It just feels like he complains and he's just snooty all the time. I mean, I want him to survive, obviously. I want them all to, but... Careful. Splinters. Thanks. Uh, I'm fine. I'm a werewolf. Guess we found the party. Alcohol. From Prohibition. These are rum running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Try vintage. Well, I guess the hackets were bootleggers. Makes sense. I guess when the quarry shut down, they branched out. Come on. Time travel later. You wanna try some of the moonshine? Some of the rum? I would try it. Rum is delicious. Hundred year old rum? You think this is But it doesn't kill you, makes you stronger. Uh, or gives you liver damage. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. But what if it cuts out my um, liver? Cool, 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 cool. Tight, 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 tight. Caitlyn! We haven't got to play as Caitlyn much. She's like the only one who I feel like hasn't sat down and had like a moment with somebody. She hasn't explained who she is, where she's from, what she's doing here at camp. She's the one I know the least about. I guess you get to know her better if you make, uh, Ryan kind of into her, but that feels a little shitty. I want to know more about her. She's cool. Uh... What the hell happened here? My bad? What did you do? Oh god, they're on to me! <laughs> I mean, I want to know what the answer to this one is, because I don't know what she's talking about. Uh, that's kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? It wasn't that bad. Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean should we go find them? Warn them? 
I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. She says she had a tumble with the locals, but didn't the guy just like take her gun and she ran away? This looks like a tornado hit it. <laughs> Maybe I'm misremembering, but it didn't happen that long ago. Wait. What? Oh, Emma's in the car. I forgot. Is there... Is there something in there? I don't know. Shoot the car. <laughs> What is it? Uh... Jacob? Emma? Are they... Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. I mean, we know what it is. Kind of kills all the tension, doesn't it? Ah! Oh! Oh! oh, she makes me! She makes me! Oh! Hey, hey, it's us! Oh, oh shit. You couldn't have looked out the fucking window? I, wait, I'm wait. so sorry. Dylan, I am so, so sorry. Oh, I didn't know it was you. I was really Dylan. scared and I thought- It's not Mace. What? Air freshener. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. I still feel like that That's would sting. I find in the van. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Febreze. <laughs> oh, my eyes. <laughs> Uh, Dylan, <laughs> you're, uh... So she was in the police station this whole time? Insane, right? This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. We never knew. Jeez. Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. <laughs> Not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the there road. There we go. So you can fix it. Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're gonna find it. That sounds like a long shot. Got something better to do? I'm not gonna be mean. I'm gonna be mean to him. Dylan, come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. Oh, we're more than that now. Trauma has exactly bonded us for life. Do? I mean, the van is nice, but it's not exactly Fort Knox. Well, there's a shelter under the lodge. You could be safe there for a while. All right. Abby, you're with me. Good luck. Okay. Dylan and Brenda. <laughs> she's like half his height. <laughs> she's so, she's so little. This really feels like Resi 8 when you're under the castle, trying to escape. What was that? Huh? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got, we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. Well, I guess he got out. We don't want any more blood on our hands. Lord bless us and save us! You keep it down. Someone's having a party upstairs. Hello, tarot cards! <laughs> Hell! There's three I found in this route. I'm a tarot card finding wizard. Still rum. <laughs> this is an old still. I guess business was booming.
Why do I have to be Ryan? I want to be Laura again. She has the gun. She's cool. She had an eye patch. She's a wolf. Sorry, right, after you, Laura. I'm right behind you. Oh no, the red room. Well, I see Jacob in there, but... Oh. What's happening? Careful. Okay. I almost slipped and died. It's coming from a bed. Jacob. Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? Uh, I don't know about that. Isn't it electrified? Bad idea. Oh, shit. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude, from oh, the woods. He used that, that depth of field is not working on that grate. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Uh, it's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got a screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. No. No, no, not my granddaughter, not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit, not my little Kaylee, God damn you, what did you do to her? I didn't do shit, Ma, not my little Kaylee. Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Wait! It's him! Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Yep. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Remember? We've got to be sure. You promised. <laughs> They took it! You fucking idiot! Come on. <laughs> Damn it! You fucking piece of shit! Get away! Get away from me! Uh, help Jacob. Okay, okay, okay. Talk me through it. Okay, so, all I know is you have to open my door and that door. And definitely not that door. Oh, <laughs> cool, thanks, detective. Okay, fuck you, man, I'm trying to help. No, fuck you, I'm trying to- Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box, or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay, hang tight. Okay. So three and five, but not seven. Come on. Uh, 
Oh, careful. Uh, breaker three, right? Uh, none of these are breaker five. What? Uh, four? All I know is the beast is in seven, right? Uh-oh. This is way too dangerous. Yeah, because you're fucked it. Okay. Dunzo. Wait, I'm sorry, dude, please. <sighs> You're better off down here. What? I'm sorry, man. No, 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 dude, come on. We'll come back for you. Shut the fuck you out, Ryan. Please, Ryan, please, dude. Okay? You don't know what to do to me. Come on. You gotta let me out. You can't let me down here. Jacob doesn't like you. I... Okay, whatever. Maybe I should open two and it would open up the one next to him? I don't know. Not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. We've been over this, Ma. What? So, you... You had those motherfucking counselors in your goddamn jail for two whole motherfucking months, right? And you are telling me now that she instead, swears a lot. I'm putting a bullet into each one of their little sorry shit-stained brains. You you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it. Is that what you are telling me now, Travis? No more blood on your hands. That's what you you, you said it. <laughs> oh my god, we are way past that now. Oh, Ma. What what if it had been me or 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 Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. You ain't no good boy. <laughs> I'm not a good boy. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. Well, I just don't, I, I don't understand why you, you, you couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer. Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker. <laughs> now I'm why she swear oh, so much? i that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in a gypsy fire. Ma. Don't ma. Don't ma me. Do you sit down? Please. Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you piece of shit. Yes. <laughs> Bang! Oh God! Ma, send Bobby down. Her beauty Whoa! This is definitely copyrighted. I'm not trusting this at all. You ain't gonna copyright me, you little musical devil. Not today. I've got keen ears and a loud mouth. You ain't gonna get me like that. But this music's epic! Hey! We do it, Balka! Do you see? <laughs> is it? Wait, this is supposed to be streamer mode, so this music is put in, but what's the actual music that's supposed to be in it? Okay. Oh, we're done. Welcome back. Did you miss me? I did. We have three cards to look at. Hopefully you've brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we?
Hmm, which one's the coolest? The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters, only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> but it's no less than she deserves. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of passion. <laughs> No, Blood I don't like that one. from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone's life. Okay. Ooh. The Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. I like the Wheel the of Fortune one. Mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. Details. Uh, yes, I would like to see more, please. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. Uh, wheel of Fortune. Was that Bobby and Travis getting Go. murdered? You've still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. Huh. Okay, thank you all, lady. <laughs> she seems to be the recurring face that we see at the start and end of every episode. She's our constant. Anyway, that does it for this one. I think we only have two more chapters to go, so we'll probably wrap it all up in the next video, which I'm very excited for. So far, everyone's still alive. Um, and what's so in the fact that they're not dead forever? So everyone is still technically savable. If if I kill Chris Hackett, I think that Nick and um, I think Nick, Max, and Laura all get saved, which is not a big price to pay, <laughs> honestly. Sorry, David Arquette, you might have to go, and you're not part of my squad. Uh, and you didn't give me my phone back for two months, and I like to check TikTok, so screw you, old man. Um, but I'm curious to see what's going to happen. I have a feeling everything is going to go wrong at the very end, but I still have two chances to save people. We'll see what happens. I'm going to have to wait until next time, and so are you. See you then for the ultimate finale. What's it going to be? Who knows? Bye-bye. <laughs>